Should I leave the merch? Uh, I think it's fine. Yeah. Right. Stay here. <laughs> Sweatshirts. There's nothing on the back. <laughs> Ta-da! It says, Winnie the Moo is to baby cow established 2022. <laughs> What do you think? <laughs> Is it giving like subtle streamer merch? Baby cow established 2022. Amazing. There she is. And it will be in, it'll be, it's hoodies, but it'll come in lots of different colors. This is just the black one I got as a sample. But it's nice, it's a nice hoodie. Feels pretty good. This launches, um, this launches March 22nd. March 22nd. Has Winnie approved? Uh, she hasn't seen it yet, but surely, but she will definitely love it. Don't worry. Ba 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 ba. Nut house. Oh, hello. Thank you. Okay, let's put this back. Dude, Push Pop wants to go. Can I bring her outside? Yeah, go for it. Cool. She would love to go for it. Dude, she wants out, man. Push pop. Would you like to go for a walk? She said yes, obviously. time for a walk. I thought she was a hundred pounds. She's a baby, but she will be a hundred pounds. Here you go. Skull here on just resubscribed for 24 months. What do you think, Push Pop? She loves it. Did you get her gender confirmed yet? No. It's a boy. Would you have said it's a boy? We've been saying it's a girl. So one of us is right. She's got grass in her eye. She's on the move. Where did you get her and what species? She's a Salcata um, tortoise. And we got her, somebody got her as a pet, as a baby in like a reptile expo. Uh, and had her for about four years. She's about four years old. Um, and then they, moved states and so they they left her behind when they made their move tortoises are really challenging to have as pets because they live like a hundred years um so it's not really realistic to think you can commit to an animal like this as a pet for that amount of time her shell does grow with her as she ages yeah their shells um it's not just like a like a rock uh, she has vessels all through her shell so she can feel everything um if i touch her shell she what is she doing oh that's what are you eating is that a rock is this poop no it's a like a nut thing she does eat rocks sometimes but it's it helps with their digestion Does the shell function as camouflage? Yeah, I guess. Uh, these guys live in uh, grasslands. You wanna go this way? In Africa? It's also called an African spurred tortoise. Let's go over here. Also called an African spurred tortoise. Um, here you go. And one of the reasons they're, they're listed, some, some places they're listed as vulnerable, some places they're listed as endangered. Their population is certainly decreasing, um, regardless of what that status is. But one of the reasons is because uh, cattle ranching. Um, so cattle are taking over their grassland habitat because we put a bunch of cattle there um, for beef production. Um, and then another reason is the pet trade. Um, a lot of people want giant tortoises as pets and you know, they're really, they're a lot of work. They're really hard to have as a pet. I'll show you guys Push Pop's enclosure. Um, and you'll see 
it is quite an ordeal building an appropriate enclosure for an animal that's going to be a hundred pounds. Um, you have to bury concrete and you have to bury wire because they can dig through brick. <laughs> um, they're really good at digging, they'll burrow in the wild. And then they need a lot of space. You wouldn't think that they were this active, but she's like super active and she needs a lot of space. Is that a flower? Oh, are you scared of, do you want to eat it? No, okay. She decided against it. She's on the move again. There's a rock under, she got stuck on the rock. <laughs> you can do it, yeah, she did it. <laughs> Four-wheel drive, baby. It's a nice day for push pop because it's like hot out and we're in the sun. Not as nice of a day for Uji though. She's off-roading. Do they stay that fast? Um, no, when they're bigger, I think they move slower. But they do cover more ground when they walk. And they are still active, just not maybe not moving at the same velocity. She is on a mission. Are they at risk of overheating? No, they're from, they're from like the plains in Africa. Uh, she'll do, she does really well with heat. Not as good right, with cold. Right. She ate 500 bits. I'm so freaking excited. Frogs and turtles <laughs> are my favorite animals on the planet and now you have both of them. Happy Gorgalvius push pop. Thank you. Yeah, that's awesome. I'm glad you're excited. I'm really excited about, about her too. I think she makes an awesome ambassador. Um, Oh, somebody said something and I forgot. Oh, uh, they don't do as well in the cold. So another thing you have to think about in building an enclosure, if you're gonna have a tortoise as a pet, is you need like, if you wanna have them outside, you either have, a, have to have a space to bring them inside with heating, like half of the year, uh, or you need to like build a separate space in their enclosure that has climate control. Um, so for her, she's got like this giant shed that has to be isol or insulated and heated half the year. She's just a big, she's a big commitment. No, she's never bit me. She never bit anybody here. Dude, she's fast. Your name's Push Pop because the way her head goes in and out. But you can also call her Poppy, and you can also call her. Uh, just resubscribed for twenty-seven months. Tortoise, I love her, and welcome home. Divna, thank you. You can also call her Poppy, or you could call her uh, Push a T, or you could call her Pop. Lock it, drop it, or you could call her Pop Tart, or you could call her Wonder Combo just Princess subscribed. Pop. What? Just ate something. I don't know what. Did she eat a leaf. Looks like a rock. Oh, do they eat rocks sometimes to help with digestion? You call her Pop Smoke. You call her uh, push it real good. You call her Soda Poppin. You call her Chance Morris. Popsicle. Pop Rocks. Pop It, Lock It, Polka Dot It. Baby Bottle Pop. Poppy Seed Bagel. Okay. Lemon Poppy <laughs> Loaf. <laughs> Otter Pop. <laughs> the Queen of Pop, Beyonce herself. <laughs> Poppy McPop face, Papa Smurf. <laughs> Paparazzi. Mary Poppins. Popper Spaniel. Papa New Guinea. The Pope. <laughs> Push Pop. Come here. Come in here. Come on, that's nice. Hello. Hi. That's nice. <laughs> Can you feel like on the top of the show? Mm hmm Yeah, they have blood vessels all through here. She could feel it. Sometimes tortoises like having brushes like mounted like this so they can scratch. Have you seen those videos where tortoises like scratch their shell on it? 
Is she so active because of her size or does it depend on their personality? I think it's a bit of both. Um, I think that Salcadas are uh, shockingly active though. Like I think they surprise people with how much personality they have. Um, at least people that aren't familiar with, with the species. And the temperature, yeah, it's nice and hot. So she's not semi-permeable like a frog since you're just handling her. Yeah, semi-permeable is a, a trait of amphibians. She's a, a reptile, tortoise. So the semi-permeable skin would be like frogs and salamanders and um, <laughs> newts. Jeez, lady, she's freaking on the move. Dude, she's got somewhere to be today. She's late for a meeting. Someone asked if she'll get too hot out here. No, they're from Africa. Um, she really likes the heat. They do really, really well in the heat.